Hey Lock Stars, it's me Tiffany. I just wanted to show you the uh, results of my color from yesterday. Um, I have pictures of it too. Um, it did, it got, uh, well first of all, I'm not unhappy with it, but it's not where I want to be, but it's a step towards where I'm trying to get to. And um, when I did my research, they say, you know, if you've already had color in your hair before, you're not just going to get straight up to the high level blonde right away. So this is a safer way of doing it because I can go ahead and do some good deep conditioning and everything. Um, I wanted my ends platinum and you can see they are not platinum. They are not lighter at all. They are light, getting lighter, but um, I think uh, I noticed that my hair did get lighter when I first did, um, when I did the second treatment of um, bleach on my hair but then what happened was um, I used the wrong toner um, I really think <laughs> you you do have to kind of like look at your own locks and you can't always go by what you see online because you know everybody's hair is different and it always it, you know it depends on what you you know what you had in your hair before and just I mean my first advice would be go to a professional go to a professional I mean the only reason why I feel confident to do it myself now is because I was blonde before with my afro for three and a half years and then I was locked and I had blonde hair for several years and then I finally went to dark and you know got uh went to a natural black and then brown and i started putting highlights in it and i went red and all of that so because i had done all that myself um the exception of going from blonde to natural black that i did go to a salon for but other than that i um you know i've done my own color so that's why i felt more confident to do it and i think it is going to be the healthy way to to go is to kind of ease into the the color but I think what I did wrong was the toner that I used was too dark um, because the 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 bleach did take it up to a brighter blonde but it did have the yellow tones and everything so I did need to get rid of it and so just the toner that I used just wasn't the right color that's really but it's gonna be fine because at least I have some low lights there for when I do blonde it up, I can um, have these low lights already there. You know, I won't have to go and put them in. So, um, so it's all good. You know, I'm a patient person. With locks, you have to be patient. You know, you learn patience when you grow locks. So I'll wait a couple weeks and I'll just work on my ends. You know, I'll work on my ends and then I'll start working on the other parts and, you know, I, I I do like how I, I started the ombre type thing going on here. So um, kind of have that. Um, I don't have any jewelry in today because I took all my jewelry, I took all my jewelry off to do my color. And I kind of let you guys know that when you do purchase my jewelry is to take all your jewelry off when you do color or tightening. Um, but I'm gonna put my jewelry back in and I have my new spring lineup, the Renaissance collection with bright, bright colors and all of that. So um, I'll put some of those in. And then when I go and when I come back um, with my hair redone, I'll probably try to wear those jewels so you can see my latest jewels, you know. But anyways, um, focus right now is to try to deep condition it and just really get, you know, get it strong and um, stronger and, and, and go back in and, and kind of work on the blonde. And I have some lock issues too right now that I'm trying to work on and I need to go to a professional to see about. Um, but that has nothing to do with, you know, my color. It's an issue that I had before, you know, this color started. Just this, the frizziness and um, I'm palm rolling now and it's just this something's just not working with whatever I'm doing so um, 
Anyways, that's why you go to professionals. They are there to help, you know, with these types of things when you cannot figure it out yourself. So, um, anyways, um, I will be back in a couple of weeks and uh, till we meet again, be safe and get some jewelry, adorn your locks, you know, get something really pretty for your locks. So um, my website is www.tiffanyslockjewels.com and I can be reached um, email tiffanyslockjewels at gmail.com and um, tag me, see me on Instagram, that's tiffanyslockjewels, you know, so anyways. I'll see you soon. Couple weeks with new hair. Okay, bye.